time now is running out for schools to buy all of the personal protection equipment that they think they're going to need to keep their students and staff safe from COVID-19. Wayne Township Schools decided it needs more equipment and more time, so it delayed the start of school by two weeks. Today, our Rich Van Wyke found out what the extra time and millions of dollars will buy. Wayne Township Schools are unpacking millions of dollars worth of PPE. 80,000 face masks and plastic face shields. For how many people? 17,000 children, 2,500 employees. And that's not enough? We don't believe it will be. That's why the school district abruptly pushed back the start of school two weeks to August 12th. Uh, we really needed some additional time to be as safe as we possibly could and to be as prepared as we possibly could. The delay buys Wayne more time to buy more PPE, like 7,000 dividers to put between students. This plexiglass. Yeah. These are also cleanable, so we can wipe them down. We have 5,000 gallons of this. Heavy duty sanitizer for teachers and custodians to use. A thousand homemade buckets of sanitizing wipes for the kids to use. You, you couldn't buy what you wanted, so you made what you wanted? That's correct. Uh, we knew that that product wasn't available. More than 14,000 new computer tablets and laptops are on the way. Every student will have one. That looks like this. And that's if they're learning at home or in case they may have to learn from home. That's right. We almost forgot the 1,000 refillable hand sanitizers. The numbers are kind of staggering. Well, and this is just the start. We think we're going to need more of everything. We know we're going to need more of everything. Some schools will also be looking for more teachers. To take on the additional responsibilities of e-learning and replace experienced teachers who have decided it's not safe for them to return to the classroom.